After overcoming countless hardships, you have at last reached the final room. You await the final question with sweaty palms. But before that, there is something that must be done. Yes, it's time to review your choices thus far. And so, laugh or cry. Here comes the last question. You can answer it if you wish or elect to not answer it. What is your greatest weapon? Are you absolutely sure? Me too, me too! You have summoned your will and selected an answer. This concludes the questioning. There are no correct answers, only the path you have chosen. Well then, the time has come to announce your destined partner. this place. I was providing backup with Fuka-chan when... Ah! Ow! I can't end up with a bruise on my butt. Wow, that was quite a surprise. Fuka-chan and I on the edge of our seat wondering who would be your destined partner, and then BAM! This labyrinth has some pretty incredible powers. Oh, were you holding my hand for me? Thanks. You can let go now. Huh? Huh? Are we, like, stuck? It seems you have reached your destination. What? This seems to be a path where lovers who met their destined partners discuss their love for each other. What could be waiting up ahead? You are free to step forth hand in hand, curiosity and fear in your hearts, or you can refrain. Hand in hand? Wait, could that be why our hands are stuck together? You are free to step forth or refrain from doing so. These are your apparent options. Now, step forth. Huh? We're supposed to stay holding hands like we're lovers or something? Hey, this better not be some kind of hidden camera thing. Jeez, what in the world's going on here? <laughs> That's so vague. But I guess it's better if we stay relaxed. No point in panicking, after all. Well, in any case, I guess we should take a look around. Jeez, is that a joke or are you being serious? Still, you're surprisingly good at playing along. <laughs> I feel a little more relaxed now. If things had gotten awkward, I probably would have panicked. Well, in any case, I guess we should take a look around. For better or for worse? Jeez, don't say it like that. Still, you're surprisingly good at playing along. <laughs> I feel a little more relaxed now. If things had gotten awkward, I probably would have panicked. Well, in any case, I guess we should take a look around. Oh, um, if we're attacked by shadows here, all I can do is cheer you on, okay? So, good luck! Suddenly, all in attendance hear an 
Announcement. An announcement? Up ahead, they see a bride and groom's joyous commemorative photograph of love. They confer between them whether to look at it or ignore it. What could it be? Should we go check it out? A wedding? Oh, this has been photo-chopped. Look at the edge of our faces. Whoever did this didn't do a good job of blurring that area. I didn't think I'd see something like that here, so I was surprised for a second. But in real life, I'm used to seeing pictures like this. They get sent to me pretty often. Though they're not this innocuous, they're a lot worse than a magical wedding of a prince and a princess. I'd definitely welcome one like this, though. Girls dream of being swept up and held like a princess by the boy they love, after all. Hmm, that's fine. I wouldn't expect a boy to understand a girl's dream. But can't you at least walk a little closer to me while our hands are stuck together? Even if it's just for now, we're lovers, right? Well, just standing around here won't do us any good. <laughs> you say that, but I bet you use that line on all the girls. Too bad, Rosette won't be fooled that easily. Hmm. Still, even if you were kidding, hearing that kind of made my heart skip a beat. Maybe. Or I could be joking, too, hmm? <laughs> well, just standing around here won't do us any good. <laughs> Jeez, what's the big idea? Uh, oh, is it because I said this is what girls dream of? <laughs> You're so sweet. Thanks. Hmm. This is a little too close to chat, though, so I'm good now. Could you put me down? You know, I'm surprised. You look thin, but you're pretty strong. You see people swept up like that in TV dramas. I didn't think anyone ever really did it. Though it did make me feel like a princess for a second. But no more doing stuff out of the blue like that. It's bad for my heart. Well, just standing around here won't do us any good. Wanna keep going? H hey, we're destined partners just because someone else said so, but putting the destiny stuff aside, we don't really know each other, huh? Even when we're holding hands like this, it's so weird. Hmm. But maybe this really is how the destined partner thing goes. They just show up out of the blue. You can't predict your destiny, so maybe the same goes for us. Just kidding. Which do you think it is? A lot of big things start out as a joke, but before you know it, they're over. Lately, I feel like opportunities only exist in the moment. That's what convinced me that I shouldn't lie to myself. Mm. Sorry, I didn't mean to suddenly get all philosophical. This is kind of embarrassing. Oh, what I said right now was off the record. <laughs> yeah, it might be. Everyone has some kind of destiny with everyone else. But what kind of relationship comes out of it all depends on the people involved. That's why I try not to lie to myself, so I form the best relationship I can with those people. If I don't do that, then I lose out on way too much. <sighs> Sorry, I didn't mean to suddenly get all philosophical. This is kind of embarrassing. Oh, what I said right now was off the record. Yikes, you're ignoring me? This must be how Teddy feels all the time. I should be nice to him later. 
Oh, what I said right now was off the record, okay? It's just between us. The long-awaited moment has come. The bride and groom are finally about to enter. The last moment of hesitation has arrived before you are to be wed. Jeez, we're not getting married. Through your own free will, you decide to vow eternal love to each other. Hey, wait a second. If we open this door, does it mean we're really getting married? Now, open the door together. Oh, I said wait! You must vow your unwavering love for one another in sickness and in health. Now, bow your love. P please wait! You can't do this! Hold the marriage! I can't believe you're marrying another woman when you already had me! Uh, isn't anyone gonna laugh? Come on! A failed joke really stings! This wedding is not approved. This is your notice of its cancellation.